Hey guys, just saw, thought I'd show you how I mounted my headlight and tail light and brake light and turn signal light onto my bike. Uh, my bike is a Hard Rock Specialized. I'm not sure what type it is, but just showing you. Uh, it's on the tripod right now. Uh, let's just take it and... Alright, sorry about this angle. Uh, just showing you there's the main part of the headlight right there. Um, this headlight has a night light, which isn't really too bright, so that's why I have my uh, regular flashlight on there, just for a main headlight. Uh, it has an 8 tune horn, which just showing you. So the tail light doesn't light up when you activate the horn. It has 8 tune means it has 8 different modes, so just showing you that was the first mode. That's the one that I use just because it's the most normal sounding. If you hold it long, you'll see what happens. It goes into a different thing. Uh, just showing you the turn signal. Left. And right. And now let's get to how I set up the brake light. Alright, hang on. Sorry for this angle once again. Just showing you. This unit is actually the brake line. This is the brake line uh, on my rear, just showing you me activating it. This was all the way in the back, this little thing. It was like back over there. So I just slotted it up, slid it up, sorry. Um, and then I just screwed it onto the cable. And now whenever you pull the brake, it turns on, let me show you. Let me just show you. Turns on the headlight. And also, let's just move back to the brake light. Oh, hang on, I'm caught. It also activates the, uh, hang on, sorry about this, guys. Not in the mood to edit it. Uh, let me just activate it. Hang on, let me just make sure it's working. Just showing you. Also activates the brake light, and here's the, here's the, uh, turn signals. This is right, well, right. And left. And something cool about the turn signal, if you change the horn, it goes with the horn. Wait, hang on. Oops. And just the problem that I had, let me just go back to the front and hang on. Let me Yes, here. Uh, just a problem that I did have. I already took this on a uh, ride around the block, but just showing you, the brake light is actually the turn signals are actually kind of hard to. They're easy to change from to go, but once it's hard to put it back in because you know you're driving, and then it's. I got used to it already, but. It's like hard to get it right in the middle, otherwise it doesn't go off. And you guys are probably wondering how this is powered. Let me show you. Oh my god. I'm sorry about this, guys. It's not in the mood to edit it out. Uh, you know what, I'll take this off the tripod for now. Uh, let me zoom out. That's a 1968 GTO chassis, my dad's. Uh, just showing you. It's powered by two double A's. I put rechargeable ones in there, just to make my life a whole lot easier. Uh, just showing you. Again, just going an overview. Uh, nightlight, if I haven't showed you this already. And it also activates when you turn it. And when you blow the horn. So, yeah, thanks guys.